Hey, we give you the facts. It's not what you think. Popeye News Link. Young King. One yard. Bless. Good morning, Popeye. Grandma watch Popeye's every morning and every night. Greetings. Greetings, viewers and subscribers. PNL Patreon team. Big up on yourself. Thanks for the support. And remember, you too can be a member of the PNL Patreon team. Just click on the link in the description below. Now, today, we are going to be dropping four videos. This is our second video for today. Later on, we'll be dropping the news roundup as well as the birthday greetings videos. Stand by for those. Now, in the video that we dropped last week, Tuesday, December 20, that was the thumbnail for that video. The guy to your right, his photos were posted in the video. And I asked persons who had any information on him to contact me. I must say, I have been contacted by many persons to include females who were victims or intended victims of that guy. You ever hear the saying, looks are deceiving? You ever hear the saying, you dare not trust your own? Well, that guy, his name is Hubert Campbell, but he's popularly known as UB. He's said to be in his 40s and he's originally from Crawford Street in Mount Salem in the parish of St. James. So here is what triggered all of this. If you look at your screen, that post, it was made on Instagram on June 19, 2020. The person who made the post said, All your baby mom know what you are going with and she supports you all the years with your dirty game. Fire fishy too. She wait till your sex off her daughter. Then she talk. Fire bun for all man who sex off little kids and them own daughter. There was this reply to the post. It says, Can't wait for him go prison and them dash with the key. He used to be my cousin, but I uncousin him years now. Him dead to me. See him so, him try different way for F me off. Long story short, hope time catch up on him and him get everything him was eagerly looking for and more damn dog shh now someone went further and commented oh my god oh well him f him daughter so what else him wouldn't do boy hubert can't believe you're still behaving this way now multiple complaints were made at the sissoka office in st james by females to include relatives and close family members of Hubert Campbell, also known as Yubi. Most of his victims were living in the Mount Salem area and their age ranged from five years old upwards. His victims included both males and females. Now, Hubert Campbell, also known as Yubi, he used blackmail to go to bed with a lot of his victims. Let me give you an example of how cruel this piece of nastiness is. One of UB's own relatives, she confided in him. She would tell him everything. What UB did was he went on social media and he created a fictitious profile and he contacted that relative. He started communicating with her and he gained her confidence. His relative and the person who she was communicating with they started exchanging photos. Are you following me? I hope I'm not going too fast. So, Yubi's relative and the person who she was communicating with, they started exchanging photos online. Remember now, this was Yubi himself, but his relative, she thought it was someone else. They ended up exchanging nude photos. That was what Yubi wanted all along. One day, the relative was contacted by a blackmailer who told her he had obtained some photos of her online and the blackmailer started making some demands of her. What did this relative do? She contacted UB, the only person she had any confidence in and she told him what was happening. UB told her, okay, just make sure you tell me what's happening and I will help you 
through all of this. The blackmailer contacted the relative again. And you want to know what the blackmailer's demands were? The blackmailer wanted her to perform a sexual act on Yubi. Take a photo of her performing the act on him and send it to him, the blackmailer. What did the relative do? She immediately contacted Yubi. Yubi told her, I'm not really into those types of sexual acts, but I will do this just for you. The relative was frightened by Yubi's response and she said no, she would not do it. The blackmailer, he then started releasing some of the relative's nude photos on a certain site online. The female, she was again contacted by the blackmailer who told her that she needed to perform the sexual act plus have sexual intercourse with UB. Take pics of both of them doing it and send them to him and he would remove the photos that he already posted on the internet. What did the relative do? She contacted UB and she told him. UB was like, well, you are my relative and I am here for you. Let's do this for your sake. The relative decided that, no, if I do this, I'm only going to give him more materials to blackmail me. Plus, you are my relative, I can't do this. The relative was broken and at one stage, she almost took her own life. It turns out that she was having a conversation with another relative one day and that relative was also stressed out. As it turned out, the relative was going through a similar situation. She too was being blackmailed and the blackmailer wanted her to perform sexual acts on UB. And the only person she confided in was Hubert Campbell, otherwise known as UB himself. As it turned out, UB was the person behind the fictitious profiles and he was also the blackmailer. Are you following me? So, let's go back to this response, to the post that triggered everything. This post that the arrow is pointing at. Let's read it again. It says, Can't wait for him go prison and them dash with the key. He used to be my cousin and I uncousin him years now. Him dead to me. See him so, him try every different way to F me off. Long story short, hope time catch up on him. And him get everything him was eagerly looking for and more. Damn dog shh. Well, that cousin was one of the relatives who you be tried to trick into going to bed with him. The good thing is that neither she nor her other relative went to bed with you be. You be, he was eventually arrested and charged in June 2020 for multiple sexual offenses we are learning that when the police checked his phone hundreds of photos and videos were found in it that's how the police located many of his victims you will be spent about 11 months in jail until he was offered bail in the sum of two million jamaican dollars by the courts we are told that one of his sisters posted bail for him you will be he has since absconded bail and he is now on the run. And it is said that UB is in the United States of America. But the question is, is he in the USA or not? No, he is not. UB is hiding in plain sight. UB is in Falmouth in the parish of Trelawney. And he is being protected by some of his very, very close family members this piece of nastiness he needs to be taken off the streets no child whether male or female is safe around ub we are learning that ub he had two brothers who died one died in a traffic accident years ago his name is dalton chisholm and he was a contractor ub also had another brother named byron campbell who also passed away the information we are getting is that UB, he might be using one, if not his two brother's identity. It is said that in the past, 
he used his brother, Byron Campbell's identity, to obtain a five-year ship visa. This guy, he should be on the St. James Police most wanted list and people need to know about him. He has been walking up and down on the streets of Falmouth and he's living his life like a normal citizen. This should not be permitted to happen. He has hurt many persons and changed their lives forever. Trelawney people, Trelawney people, I am sure one of you might have seen him, informed on him, your son, your daughter, your brother, your sister, your niece, your nephew is not safe around him. Do the right thing. And anyone out there who have a story to tell about this guy or anyone else like him, send me a WhatsApp message to 876 343 1034. That's 876 343 1034. Blessed love, everybody. Tell a friend, for tell a friend, for tell a friend about Papa in News Link. And PNL Blog TV. Like, subscribe, and share. Quick Silver Sin. If we just unite, what a country this will be. If we just unite, Jamaica live in unity. If we just unite, what a country this will be. If we just unite, Jamaica live in unity. Hey, cry with a mash up Jamaica. Criminals them a mash up Jamaica Jamaicans mash up Jamaica Oh Jamaica, me sweet Jamaica Cry me to mash up Jamaica Criminals them a mash up Jamaica Jamaicans mash up Jamaica Oh Jamaica, me sweet Jamaica I could have sun shine a rain Jamaica, no problem, no pain Good boy them no go to your team But me want me country back, give me me country back Murder, don't you be a bit me here, them a murder.